you said that you know you were mining documents, mining information about the NDDC and the activities in that uh, commission for a year before any announcement was made by anybody, which you had to contravene with your own documents. The Niger Delta Development Commission started work in 2000. This is 2020, 20-year-old 20 organization. From your findings, how far back does this fraud date? Started in year 2000, the same year the commission was established. But you know, there's a limit to what uh, we can get out. We have uh, been involved in agitation for a better uh, Niger Delta region. We have criticized oil companies, we have criticized stakeholders, we have criticized the commission for a number of years. But it got to a time that we decided to change strategy. Don't leave the thing as just criticizing. Don't leave the thing as just raising some allegations or just making some noise. So we decided to sit down and change our approach to issue. So we said, okay, let's get something done. Sit down, establish cases that can be proven both in the public and in the law court. So it took us a lot of time to get that done. And it took a lot of processes, confirmation upon confirmation. I don't want to go to prison. So it was after we got this definite uh, uh, um, assurance that a lot of things ongoing there, scam. If a hundred billionaire is, in fact, they said they, they, said they got 305 billion last year. Go and check in the Niger Delta in the last one year. If you will see anything, any impact near 20 billion naira, I put that fact. I doubt, in fact, I doubt if you will see that at all in the last yeah. one year. Okay, now, you know. Corruption in that place before, you know, the place has been a cesspool of corruption from inception. I have said it before.